You are listening to Proof Text, a Glossa House podcast exploring scripture and all things related to it. New episodes are released daily. For more information, check out glossahouse.com and subscribe to our channels on Spotify and YouTube. Welcome and enjoy. Kedete pantes egoimi iese ke tu to estin zon elenisti. Hello everyone. I'm Jesse Orloff and this is Living in Greek. Over the past several uh, episodes, we have been in Mark chapter 1. Uh, several episodes ago, I read verses 1 through 15, and then we've had two episodes where we've drilled down into a few specific verses and asked some grammatical questions about those verses. Today, what I wanted to do was pray in a kind of a guided way being guided by this passage a little bit. I want to do this as uh, as spontaneously as I can. So I haven't I haven't really prepared a, a, a script or anything like that. In this case, I've I've written down a few notes of some things I I, I might want to cover, but I really want to just uh, see what we can do to pray using this scripture to kind of guide our thoughts and our minds. So I'm going to go ahead and share my screen and pull back up that scripture just so that we can have that in front of us as we begin. All right, so I have it on my screen now. Let's go ahead and and begin praying. And one thing I want to call out here is as I do this, you know, it's okay if your prayers are slow, if your speech is slow, if you're trying to figure out what to say, I think it's okay even if you get things wrong and um, don't get it quite right. Uh, the point of this isn't perfect accuracy. It's an opportunity to start producing some output. So you might see me make those mistakes and I ask for your grace in those cases. And uh, with all that being said, let's pray. Prosev Chometha. Pater Emon. To mensu oti kalos i ke dia tu evangeliu tu Iesu Christu tu viu tu viusu ke ev Christo mensu dia dia tu Ioanu ke dia uh, tu agap a uh, dia tes agapesu ev haristo mensu oti apestilas ton angelon ton angelon su uh, ton angelon ioanen os kateskevasi tenodon Su tenodon tu iusu Iesu Christu. Ev Christo mensu oti oti Ioannes oti Ioannes ekeriusen baptisma metanuas is afesin hamartion ke ekeriusen pros Prostus iudeus, ke prostus irosolumitas, pater agapo mensu, ke thelomen akuluthin akuluthin siu ke akoluthin a uh, to wiosu ieso a uh, iesu christo o iesus e kedusen oti peplerote o keros ke engiken e vasilia tu theu 
que o Jesus Jesus uh, aquele sen o tipis devete em to evangelio que é Cristo mensu o ti o ti piste uh, o ti pistevo men em to evangelio que pistevo men en <coughs> en to uiosu Jesus Cristo O Jesus, O Jesus e egape, e, egapa, egapa e mas, que siu, siu, did, siu didocas e mas ton uionsu is afesin a Martion e Mon Ut Utos est in megas Megas Svodra Ke Kalos Svodra Agapo men Agapo men Agapo mense Ke Thelo, uh, thelomen, thelomen, uh, keriusin, thelomen keriusin, to evangelio, uh, keriusin, uh, ton evang, uh, to evangelion, pros, pros, tus, us, uh, U pistevusin en siu. Uh, Prosevhometha panta, pa, tafta panta, en to, on, uh, en to onomati tu Iesu, To curio e mon. Amen. All right, everyone. So we just did the, uh, we, we walked through Mark 1 and we just prayed uh, what came to mind. I tried to use the scripture itself to kind of guide some of my thoughts there. I know for sure that I, I got, um, you know, I, Use some poor grammar, and I, I, you know, had a lot of pauses and and mixed some things up. But regardless, it was an opportunity for us to thank God for His Son, for us to thank uh, thank God for His Word and the Scripture that He had before us. Thank God for His Gospel, and um, you know, and in all of that, we can be incredibly thankful and we can use this language that we are learning to praise him. And so I hope that that was helpful and I hope that that we can do more of those things in the future. So thank you for your time and I will see you next time. Interested in growing your ancient language skills but not sure where to start? Glow's House can help. From illustrated readers and short stories to lexicons and grammars, Glossa House offers a variety of resources for beginning, intermediate, and experienced ancient language learners. Head to glossahouse.com today. Glossa House, language resources for the global community.